Yo out there ladies and gents, how's it going? In this video, I'm gonna show you how to fit the engine protection to the wonderful Aprilia Touareg 660. It's not gonna be difficult, but there's a few little steps that you've gotta go through, um, torque settings and lock tight and all that sort of stuff, just to make sure it's done properly. Let's crack on, shall we? And we keep that vibe from a side down. Hopefully you can see okay, hopefully it's not too dark and dingy. It's a lovely day, but a dark bike means that the color correction of the GoPro sometimes hides things, hides details. But anyway, first of all, we've got to remove this bolt here and this bolt here. Both these bolts are 13 millimeter. So you've got my 13 mil socket. So now we've got these two bolts out, what we need to do is get the, uh, the framework for this side of the bike just loosely um, attached to it so it just sits in place nicely. Now before we can attach this, I've just got to put a little bit of thread lock onto the bolts that we're going to be using for it. That's covered me in Loctite. <laughs> Hopefully it's uh, put enough on the, uh, on the threads. This long bolt has a little washer. That goes through there. And this one goes through there. This one is once again a 13 mil. Now I'm not doing these up tight, just putting them in enough so they don't flop around too much. This is an 8 mil Allen head. I should do that for the moment. Next we've got to put in the cross piece which goes in front of the, uh, the, the motorcycle. I'm just going to reposition the camera. Something the instructions don't tell you is that you have to remove this clip here to be able to put the bar across. And that I think is a T25 Torx bit. removed um, and now I've got to try and get the uh, the bar in I might have to put this back in afterwards I'm not sure so that slots in the end of the framework that we've just bolted on and then these line up up here so these bolts got two of these they've already uh, got Loctite on them, um, they're 8 mil. Like with the engine bars, I've not done these up tight, they're just just in there so it can still all move around. And then one final bolt on this side, which is a six mil Allen key. And again, not doing these up tight. Now to do the same on the other side. Lucy this one, Lucy that one. The difference on this side is you've just got that space in there. Got your long bolt, washer, a little bit of Loctite, thread lock, and then make this up, making sure that your top bar slots in as well. Now 
when I picked these up from Brighton Moto, Kevin uh, suggested that I used some cable ties just to hold everything in place. Um, but it all seems pretty solid and I've not really needed to do that. Uh, I think it's a good idea though. And again, on this one, a little bit of Loctite. This one's got its own thread lock on it already. Okay, so that's everything loosely attached. Now I just need to go around and tighten everything up. Piece of pee, piece of wee wee. They're all nipped up, now I need to torque them. These ones are to 10 newton meters. Um, it's gonna be a real pain. for those ones. These ones are at 25 newton meters. And this one and this one are at 50 newton meters. Well, it's actually 50 newton meters plus or minus 15. So uh, yeah, you've got a lot of tolerance on these. But I'm just going for 50, because that's the number. And there you have it, there's your frame protection. All solidly mounted, dead simple to do, easy peasy, nice one. So that's a nice simple install, easy peasy to do yourself, just make sure you've got correct torque wrenches for it um, and uh, decent tools to be doing things up so you don't round things off or anything like that. But yeah, piece of cake. Um, these are the official Aprilia crash bars. I'm sure the other ones that you can get a mount pretty similarly. Um, but yeah, there might be differences between these and the other ones for how they mount. I still need to put in the cable uh, clip again, just to make sure that's nice and tidy. But yeah, piece of cake, piece of cake. So if you haven't done so already, click that subscribe button. There's a few other bits of uh, Aprilia Touareg footage on my channel, including a first look review. Um, I've done some green laning on it. I'm gonna be doing the motor camping trips and all that sort of stuff. So it should be worth you clicking that subscribe button just to see what we get up to with this bike and you can see what an amateur like me can get away with on uh, such a very confident motorcycle as this. Anyway, like I say, click that subscribe button. If you like the video, give it a little thumbs up. If you didn't, you can give it a little thumbs down. I don't mind at all, that's fine. It's all cool in the school. But please drop in a comment. I very much love hearing from you. If you've got the pretty Touareg, if you fit the bars yourself, or if you've got the dealer to do it, how are you finding them? Um, are they sturdy? I've not tested them yet, as you've just seen. Just fitted them. But anyway, you ride safe, take care, and I'll catch you all in the next one. Uh, bye bye for now. Keep that bar. Rubber side down. Yeah, you know, you gotta keep that bar. Rubber side down. <laughs>